Hey guys, uh, welcome back to the channel. So today we're going to be doing a little bit of rock hounding and we are at an undisclosed location in the uh, Wasatch mountain range and I don't know if um, you guys can see this but that's where we're hiking to today. Up there to those mines. And as you can see there's already a tailing right there. And I guess they're not really mines, they're mine tailings but Look at all this vegetation, you guys. Walking through all this stuff, it gets so humid. Okay, so I think I'm on top of my first set of tailings. But I want to go take a look through that. And what that has in it is some garnet. So I was just searching for about two seconds and I found what I was talking about. So I don't know if you guys can tell, but right at the tip of my finger is a type of garnet, I believe. In the comments if I am wrong and if you know this, what this is, but I can kind of just peel away that red stuff. And then all of a sudden, all the garnets will be exposed right here and right here. But once you take a toothbrush to that, it'll all be awesome. And this one has some bigger chunks right there. So I don't know if you guys have ever been to any mine tailings in um, the Wasatch, but any mining road that you walk up is going to be very steep. It's like so steep, but it's so beautiful up here. Like, it's just awesome. Like, I love it. So, I have no idea what this rock is. But it's pretty awesome because it has that iron stained rock, but it also has a whole bunch of layers of quartz or something in there. And it has a cool coloring right there. It's a cool rock. I just found it right next to these other ones. Oh, there's a big chunk of it. Cool. So, as you can see, I'm going the right direction. Um, I was just walking. Big chunks of this ore. So, I just gotta keep walking up this not really path. And the tailings are just right there. But... I wanted to keep this rock because I thought it looked cool. Whew, it's a tight squeeze going through here. Ugh. Ugh. Okay. So, I have tailings to my right. Come up out of the trees. And I have a big, big set of tailings right there. I cannot walk up that. You do not want to slide down something like that. So I'll just check at the bottom for some cool looking rocks and easily accessible places so I don't die. But, ooh, that one's awesome. I don't know if you guys can see that, but that is like multicolored. What the heck? That one's cool. That one is definitely a keeper. I can't believe that's natural. That's trippy. That's cool. I tell you what, you don't want to be sliding down that. Uh-uh. Nope. 
No, this isn't scary. Okay, just don't look. Woo. Tell you what, that ain't good. No siree. I'm where I wanted to be. And I don't know if you guys can see that, but right up there in those trees, there's a little X with that mine shaft. And one time I thought it'd be fun to hike up to that. Bad idea, almost died, never again. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go hike up that ravine and try to find some fossils. But I'm gonna pay attention this time because last time it was not good. But it's awesome up here. Um, this is the last place I'm gonna go to. But I'm gonna go make my journey up there. So, walking up the trail, I just found me an ammonite fossil. I don't know if you guys can see the spiral in that, but that's pretty cool. So unfortunately, I cannot get that ammonite fossil out. Oh, I just found this chunk. It has a whole bunch of little calcite shells in it. I think I'm gonna keep this one though. And then I also just spent a minute and I broke up, I don't know if you guys can see that, but there's like scales, like fossilized scales or something at the tip of my glove. So I'm gonna keep these ones. And I'm gonna keep looking through here for a second because I think this place has some good fossils right here. There's some shells. It's pretty cool some of the stuff you can find. So you guys, I just found something super, super, super cool. So I just was looking through here and I seen this one first, and I was just looking. And then I looked underneath it, and it's a whole fossilized fin of a fish. That is just awesome. I didn't think I'd find something like that. But then it's got some other stuff here but that is just so cool. I can't believe I live, I'm finding stuff. What is that? What is that? Is that a... I can't tell if this one is a fossil or not. It really looks like it. Oh my gosh. I have no idea, but that one definitely is. So, that is just awesome. So, these are definitely fish scales that I found right there on the end. And then right here. And then I think there's something else right there, but I can't really get it. So I'm gonna pause you guys for a second and see what I can do. Okay guys, so I just barely made it down to the bottom of the ravine. That thing is deadly, let me tell you. Anyways, has some cool rocks, but I'm getting out of here. So, I hope I can make it down this thing without slipping. At least I'll only slide for a minute. This one's not a death fall. Okay, whew. That was just steep trying to get down that little section. Woo! Easy there, can't fall at the bottom. Okay. Whew! Alrighty then. 
Well, back on somewhat level ground. Oh yeah. Here's that death part. That ain't good. Just gotta walk straight. Trust me, don't wanna go down there. So I didn't come up this way, I came up a different way. But here's another um, set of tailings, but this one's pretty large actually. Not seeing super awesome stuff. I mean, there's this piece right here that has a little bit of crystals with a little bit of crystals with like some iron staining, but nothing super, super amazing. But ah, almost slipped there. But yeah, it's pretty cool. Kind of wish I could go down that, but probably wouldn't be too smart.